10 Weirdest Bicycles in the World Number 10. Perhaps frustrated by one too many delays at New York City's Penn Station, design exec Judah Schiller came up with an ideal way to get from New Jersey to Manhattan, a water bike. Schiller's bike raft hybrid is a mountain bike attached to a frame that rests on two inflatable pontoons. When the rider pedals, the propeller turns, keeping the bike moving at a speed up to 10 miles per hour and also allowing full use of handlebar steering. The entire contraption can be set up in 15 minutes and broken down in five, leaving riders with a road-ready bike and a backpack full of accessories weighing less than 20 pounds. Schiller has pedaled his water bike across both the Hudson River and San Francisco Bay. Number nine, Josh Bechtel's Bisimple eschews this normally critical component and relies instead on a direct drive freewheeling hub, one that joins the crank arm axis with the rear wheel axis. This creates a shorter wheelbase and a somewhat bizarre appearance, with the pedals on the rear wheel and the bike seat directly above it. Despite this unusual look, the Bisimple rides much like a single speed bike, save for an optional rear steer mode that allows you to navigate sideways. Number eight, the German designed Hallbrad packs the two wheels, pedals and handlebars of a bicycle on a re-engineered rear triangle. This half bike actually looks more like a third of a bike. It pedals the streets and carries and stores easily thanks to those compact dimensions. Clearly aimed at the ever-growing urban mobility market, the Hallbrad is a simpler commuter bicycle that looks perfect for the smallest city apartment and houses. To ride the super compact bike, you sit on the saddle, grab hold of the handlebars that run below the saddle, and pedal away. Number seven. Feeling his 15-foot stupid tall bike just wasn't stupidly tall enough, LA cinematographer Richie Trimble created the Stupid Taller. At a little more than 20 feet in height, it's considered the world's tallest bicycle. The bike is a 275 pound contraption made from a monster beach cruiser, eight bicycle chains linked together, and two 36 inch wheels. Trimble built it in just four days. Number six. Inventor Michael Killian loves the sensation of balancing on top of a snowboard, carving graceful curving arcs in the snow. He also loves tinkering with stuff. Put those two joys together in a workshop and you get the sideways bike. Killian's fantastic wheeled creation. On his website, Killian says the lean forward or lean back balance you use on the sideways bike offers finer control than the side to side lean of a normal bike. Whether or not that's true, it sure looks like a ton of fun. Number five. In September 2013, former pro cyclist and flying Scotsman Graham Obrey and his bicycle Beastie set the world speed record for fastest cyclist in a prone position, clocking in at 56.62 miles per hour. Obrey's speed cycle requires him to ride in a recumbent head forward belly down position and features rear levers that allow Obrey to pedal horizontally after a push start. There's also a shoulder brace for rider stability. And because the bike can go nearly 60 miles per hour, Obrey encased the entire thing in a Kevlar and fiberglass shell to protect him from injury. It features a small window up front and a snorkel for breathing. Number four, members of Michel van Maar's Werkplug in Netherlands built what's considered the world's longest bicycle in 2011. It's 117 feet, five inches long, has two wheels and no stabilizers. This super long bicycle requires two people to work, one steering up front and another pedaling in back. Number three, want a bike you can slip into your suitcase? Created by Karsten Betten, the Quiggle has a hinge that allows it to fold down into a compact package, comes with 8-inch wheels, and weighs about 14 pounds. It's designed to be ridden standing up, though it includes a seat for stability and can reach up to 15 miles per hour. While it's currently a prototype, Betten is hoping to make a multiple gear model with either 8 or 14-inch wheels available to the public soon. Number two, it may look like a sports car, but the Ferrari Farfalla FFX is actually a recumbent style quad bicycle with an upscale exterior. Built in 2012, the aluminum frame bike is made for one or two drivers, though it forgoes steering wheels for handlebars and runs on human power. It boasts an 11-speed hub gearbox, 
200 ultra-bright LEDs for evening cycling, and the coolest feature, a built-in butterfly mechanism that causes the wing doors to lightly flap while pedaling. Number 1. British inventors John Foden and Yannick Reed came up with a dream vehicle, a bicycle that can fly. The Explore Air Paravelo can reach up to 15 miles per hour on the road, 25 miles per hour in the air, and up to 4,000 feet in altitude. It consists of a two-wheeled folding bicycle made from aircraft-grade aluminum and a lightweight trailer that holds a powerful fan with a biofuel-powered 249cc motor, plus a flexible wing that doubles as a tent for longer trips. An electric starter fires the motor and turns the fan, creating considerable thrust and, with a long enough runway, getting the Paravelo off the ground. It can stay airborne for up to three hours.